he ran outside, Brown that is, the teen kept shooting while being told by his mother to do so. Brown died as a result. I am disheartened that people were there especially men that were there that watched this happen. Uh, and it had to be a 14 year old boy to save his mother. Once they got a hold of this video, saw what the defense would be, and that defense would be self-defense. Because now that the defense has a claim, a very strong one it seems, that uh, they were, the shooter was acting in defense of his mother, who was being pummeled by an assailant. That's a pretty hard case to bring on murder charges. of this year, my life changed, my son's life changed, I've experienced pain in, in many ways, many ways that I would never have thought, never, what happened to me was totally unnecessary, never in a million years would I have imagined being brutally attacked, beaten, and then arrested. appreciate and recognize that when a woman is violently attacked by a man, an unarmed woman, that she shouldn't be arrested. In the near future, I will be able to respond to outpouring of support. Again, I just need a little time to heal and to just get my life back with my baby. Thank you all from the bottom of my heart.
Sheriff's Office arrested three people for allegedly bringing guns to a preschool graduation. But the family of one claimed she had been wrongfully arrested. Now, after the woman spent four weeks behind bars, the charges have been dropped. Even so, that woman says unfair treatment by the Sheriff's Office continues. I was actually in jail with people that have second degree murder attempted murder to the police, to a police officer, and all they buys was cheaper than mine. I kept telling my mama, like, you gotta get me out of here, like, I can't do this. Alicia Hood with your mother, with your sister, with your daughter. If your mother or sister or daughter were attacked in a restaurant when she's trying to order a cheeseburger, would you expect that she would be arrested? What would you do in that situation? 